Hello everybody, welcome to this new video. Now today we are going to see a comparatively new Earth observation platform from where you can download both premium and free satellite images. So let's go ahead and see that. You need to just write SOAR dot art don't worry i will leave a link in the description box so you can easily find that platform all right all right so at first you will find something like this now you need to sign in at first to download satellite images now you can do a, nearly everything without signing up but you can't download anything so it's just free signing up you need to just uh, provide your email address and set a password it's free do that first now you see we have multiple options here maps satellites drones so they do have also drone images and we'll see that later okay you can also upload maps or drone images now go ahead with satellite images let's go click satellites and you see you have multiple options you can download sentinel images NASA images that is Landsat 7 8 and some of the new satellite images are upcoming all right now let's go ahead with that first sky map sentinel hub and NASA NASA satellites are totally free and you need to pay for this sky map now why is that map why what's the speciality of this sky map 50 because it's a high resolution image its resolution is 50 centimeter that is 0.5 meter on the other hand <clears throat> sentinel 2 has a 10 meter resolution now let's say for example to cover a 300 meter by 300 meter crop field if you are using landsat 8 image that is 30 meter resolution you will have only 10 pixels that's a tiny amount of data actually 10 pixels now if you are using sentinel 2 you will have around how much how many um 30 30 pixels that's comparatively high now if you are using this sky map that is 0.5 meter resolution then 300 divided by 0.5 that is 600 you will get 600 pixels to cover a 300 meter 300 by 300 meter field so you will have finer details of that image a special resolution let's say for example 10 meter means that the lowest size of an art object this image can capture is has to be 10 meter at least so using this skymap 50 image you can capture 0.5 meter objects on earth all right now you can see here we have three options new collect archival and custom job now before that you need to go ahead to your area of interest you can search right here or you can just navigate to the place what you like okay now you can check you, you can see here here we have bunch of base maps so let's go with google hybrid let's say for example las vegas this is my area of interest now at first go with archival then i will try new collection click on archive and what is that going on little hybrid yeah draw aoi now you have this plus sign now you can draw a rectangle as your area of interest you see at first it was red color it says too small the smallest area smallest threshold is 50 square kilometer so it has to be at least 50 square kilometer and below i guess to 300 square kilometer yes so you see after 300 square kilometer it's getting red all right so let's say for example this area right now i am interested now you see it's now providing you all the images for this area in the archival and you see cloud cover 000 and date of that image it's quite recent actually 
February 4th. Now you need to see which tile is going to cover your study area. You see this tile, this last one, is covering most of the study, the study area. So click on that, it's buffering, just collecting it. And to completely cover that area, you need to select another one. You can use this one. Oh, you can see here, there's one, just, yeah. This one completely covers our study area. Oh no, there's a bit missing. Let's go with it. There's a preview. So the, by this preview, you can see, a, you can do a comparison. Here you can see sky map view and sentinel to view. This is sentinel to compared to the sky map, you can see it's not that clear. Okay, you can see here you can see this zone is was quite unclear. It's, it's quite large. And sentinel image it's small all right so close it and now continue and you can see there's a price rate 597 now you need to confirm that you need to provide your information and then they will they will send you this image by mail okay go back and yeah archival so if you use archival it will cost you i think 50 percent lower than new collect now let's go ahead with new collect new collect is actually they will do everything for you in the background so draw aoi so here you don't have to adjust images i mean you don't have to make any mosaic they will do that for you so here you can see price is quite high and it actually depends on your area of interest how long is it if it's a large area then it will cost you more okay then confirm confirm and then you have to provide uh, payment details then they will send the image it's i think a five band image they will send you the file okay so that's all about this sky map 15. Now they also do have drone images. If you cl click on drones, yeah. Now drone images are quite handy if you are going to use a build, a, let's say for example, deep learning model. So now let's say for example, your area of interest is this one. You can search that and find, if you find a drone image, for you area of interest then that's good this image will cost you i think it's location and 25 dollar most of them are 10 dollars now if you don't find your preferred areas drone image maybe you can mail them and they if they can collect that for you they'll contact you so yeah that's it and you can also upload drone images and earn some money if they if anybody buy your drone images okay so there's uh, all right they also provide the uh, tutorials so you can there's also a youtube channel soar.art where you can find some other tutorials regarding this this platform okay so that's it for now i hope you find this video helpful if you find if you have any questions regarding it you can comment that in the comment section down below thank you for watching